One of the key challenges that corporations face, especially when we're talking about communications, is having uniformity between all the messages that are going out. My desire is to have an alignment between the style of communication internally and the style of communication externally. And so the faster and better are those bridges between what's going on internally and externally, we get a what we call a more transparent organization. There's a divide that we've seen in business today with the old school of management taught to listen to the professor and not really to question it. We have a new generation that views that as being very uninspiring. So the issue for these companies is to find a way for their brands, to find some humanity to them, some personality, allow them to be who they are, so they don't have to fit a tailor-made tie, straight jacket type of approach, allows them to be who they are and, and, and work for a higher cause. Because many of these people have had great success all their lives. And so they're like, well, why, what's the motivation to actually change? I only have 10 more years to go. And the issue is that it's no time to waste. We have to shift. And the time is now. One of the things that I provide is training. And, uh, and typically come back, oh, it's so expensive. And there's a quote from, I think it's Eleanor Roosevelt, that says, if you think education is expensive, try ignorance. So when I'm, I'm talking with a CEO, what I would want to do is find out what his or her objectives are. Sometimes the objectives are, are a little bit vague or are, are not actually very realizable within the organization. So I will dig down and see how it's actually working within, within the team to see if what they're trying to achieve in digital is going to be re realistic within the organization. In order to make an environment successful for an employee to feel like they are completely personally fulfilled, I think the, the key is to be aligned with the values of the organization. The brands that actually get it right for me are the ones that have values that are not just written on the wall, but are lived by the people in the company. And if the CEO or the leadership team isn't embodying that personality, well then you're going to have a disconnect. And the disconnect is like entropy. It takes away from the desire to do the extra. And that's what makes the difference for brands. The thing that inspires me the most in the professional space are people that I feel are genuine and, are, and have managed to take off that corporate tie and be the people they are in the morning when they're shaving, having breakfast with their family, working with people, operating, leading, giving direction, and then at home with friends. People that are able to be who they are consistently. And organizations don't allow for that personal conversation to align who you personally are with what your professional objectives are. You need to get that link going. You need to allow that conversation to happen. And then people are going to be a lot more, I think, open. One of the things I think is missing in an organization is the opportunity to have fun. Get the opportunity to find ways to, to learn every day, to explore your own personal emotion. Allow that in a corporate environment, and then we can have some fun.